guys, it's your girl Saba. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Guys, are you ready for Thanksgiving? Because <laughs> I'm not, but that's okay because I'm coming to you with a taste test. I'm testing Palmini's mash to see if it's worth putting on our Thanksgiving plates. So let's jump right in with this taste test. If you don't know what Palmini is, Palmini is a company that works with Hearts of Palm to create products like rice, pasta, and now their version of mashed potatoes. Now you may have seen this in the past if you've been a subscriber for a while. I have used this for my copycat version of Chipotle's lime rice recipe. It was perfection, y'all. I'll link that up above and below for you so you can watch that after this video. And I also made my baked shrimp scampi with the linguine pasta from Palmini. So I love this brand and when I saw this I was like I have to get my hands on this mash to check it out. The great thing is it comes in a pouch like this. I bought a pack of three um, and they have tear alongs on the side so you can rip open the pouch. Ooh. Woo! <laughs> I didn't think that was gonna happen. It has a very acidic smell to it like a lemony smell. I love that. I don't have a problem with that, but you know, I just want to say FYI. They're giving you directions at the back of the packet. I have a little variation that I'm going to use, so let's start with that. Getting the Palmini mash out of the pouch was a little bit tricky. The design made it hard to scoop the mash out, and I hate wasting food, and I was trying to get every single morsel out of this pouch, but I couldn't get to the corners, and I almost cut my fingers scooping this mash out. I definitely prefer Palmini's can design over the pouch. To enhance the flavor, I added garlic. As a pro tip, use minced garlic. I couldn't find my mincer, so I used chopped garlic instead, but using minced garlic helps you properly mix the two ingredients together. And I'm just real curious right now, so I'm just gonna taste test this already. Mm. So it definitely has a very similar consistency to mashed potatoes. It's a little more wet. And I think when we heat this up, it will dry out a little bit so it's like fluffy. But so far, so good. I was kind of concerned with the combination of the garlic, but I think this is going to be a move. So what they want you to do now is put this in the microwave for a minute and 30 seconds. I'm going to heat mine at 30 second intervals. My microwave is super powerful and I don't want this to get extremely hot. This is what the Palmini mash looks like after being heated up in the microwave for about a minute and a half. And now I'm going to give it another good stir just to make sure both the garlic and the Palmini mash are mixed together well. So far I'm loving the texture and the look and feel of the mash. It's definitely giving me mashed potato vibes. I'm adding in Greek yogurt to help get that fluffiness that we all know and love from traditional mashed potatoes. And I'm also adding olive oil to help with the texture and taste. Add some seasonings and mix the ingredients together. Now it's time to eat, okay? So I'm gonna get a bowl and I'm gonna plate this and we're gonna get a little fancy and I'm gonna add some dry chives but you can definitely use whatever toppings you prefer. It's time to taste test this Palmini mash. Wish me luck, y'all. Okay, okay, Palmini, you guys did that again. This is gonna be on the Thanksgiving plate for sure. One, the consistency, so similar to mashed potatoes. I love mashed potatoes. It's fluffy and it's light. Oh, I'm loving this. Mmm. The other thing I will say is I need more. <laughs> like that little bitty pouch, that's not enough. Like, I needed a can. Yes. Mm -hmm -hmm. I also want to talk about the cost because if you're serving a large party, you're going to need quite a number of pouches. 
So, you know, it may not be as cost effective as cauliflower, but this is worth the try. And if you're the only one who's keto or low carb friendly, this is gonna be a great serving size for you and somebody else. But if you're feeding like 10 people, you're gonna need probably five pouches. Taste, color, texture, so similar to mashed potatoes. Honestly, this gets a 10 out of 10. I will definitely be serving my palmini mash. I'm loving it. Thank you, Palmini. If you want more recipes with Palmini, give me a thumbs up, drop a comment down below, show some love by sharing this video with everyone. Thank you so, 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 so much for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, click that red subscription button below, join the fam, stay safe, and happy safe brain.